Question number 1. What are the purposes of vernier height gauge? Answer, for making parallel lines on the workpiece to the accuracy of 0.02 mm in metric system and 0.001 in inch system. For comparing heights of finished workpiece. Question number 2. What is the use of vernier bevel protractor? Answer, vernier bevel protractor is used to measure and check the angles of a job to the accuracy. Question number 3. What is the function of a vernier depth gauge? Answer, a vernier depth gauge is used to measure and check the depth of blind holes, steps, etc. Question number 4. Why micrometer carries a ratchet stop? Answer, ratchet stop supports to measure accurate reading applying uniform pressure on the measuring faces irrespective of operator. Question number 5. Specify the term backlash of a micrometer. Answer, backlash is the lack of motion or lost motion of the spindle when the rotation of the thimble is changed. The question number six, mention the features of a universal bevel protractor. Answer, minimum reading is five minutes. Main scale and vernier scale are on the same plane to eliminate the reading parallax. Fine adjustment of the blade ensures the precision measuring and laying out of the angle. Main parts are of hardened stainless steel to prevent rust. Combined with an attachment or height gauge, a wide range of measurements is available. Question number 7. What is a gear tooth vernier caliper? Answer. Gear tooth vernier caliper is made with vertical and horizontal scales. So movement can be taken at a time with these two scales. It is used to measure the cordal addendum and cordal thickness of a gear tooth within the accuracy of 0.02 mm or 0.01. Question number 8. State the uses of a dial test indicator. Answer. To check the parallelism of machined or ground surfaces, to check the true rotation of round jobs, to compare the dimensions of finished components. Question number 9. What are the functions of a comparator? Answer. The components can be checked quickly during mass production for the inspection of newly procured gauges. In selective assembly of parts, where parts are graded in groups depending upon their tolerances, as laboratory standard where working and inspection gauge is set and correlated. Question number 10. What is a gauge? Answer. A gauge is a checking instrument which is commonly used in tool room and machine shop for checking the finished components. Question number 11. Point on the advantages of gauges. Answer. It increases the production. It saves the time. It makes the parts interchangeable. It reduces the supervision charges. It minimizes the production cost.